Hello, and welcome. I'm Xander, and uh, I'm sorry about not posting a Minecraft episode for a long time. This room is finished up. I took the advice of putting the water under the table. As you can see, I've used some glowstone. And I've put uh, glowstone... I haven't done anything with the lighting in this room yet. Uh, I finished the front out here. I've just been working on and off, and not actually really been doing a whole lot. So... Oh, it leaves the whole way around here, and there's glowstone lighting out here, and there's some up there, which I'll show you what I did upstairs. Uh, I, this is all the more, uh, uh, basically I tried to farm ender pearls, but I wasn't doing a very good job of it, so this is what I have for now. But, uh, I've put the entire roof in, these are half slabs, so nothing will spawn up there. I put in a little, like, roofed kind of patio area on this section. It's not patio. It's, it's not quite a balcony. But, uh, fenced it off for good measure. Put a little hot tub type thing there. And I haven't really put any furnishings really in these rooms, aside from the glass and the roof. Um... I got the lighting in here because it helps light the bottom as well. And I've got torches just everywhere. Uh, these torches... Why aren't, whatever. I don't know why those aren't aligned. But I've also put this on up here. Which... I originally didn't want to use even more glowstone up here. But I wanted to make sure nothing could spawn. And I had to put some light up there to make sure that nothing would spawn on that roof bit either. But uh, I've got five eyes of ender, and I've brought blaze powder, so in case I find more endermen and whatnot. And I've brought my well, one of the unbreaking picks I have. This isn't the efficiency five one; that one's still there. Uh, the fortune pick, the power one bow, a sword. All the arrows I have to my name, to my knowledge. Stack and a half of food, lava, water, wood, coal, a workbench, and some blocks. So, I guess without further ado, try this trek again. Now it's clearly over in this way somewhere. So, I don't know, maybe I will meet back up with you once we end up at where we were last time, so I'll be back with you in a bit. Okay, I'm in a desert. I don't know if it's the same one, but I keep on getting conflicting results from the, uh, the ender the ender eyes. Eyes of enders. Because some of them keep telling me go this way. And I go this way, and I throw another one, and then it says no, go this way. So I go to where it went, I throw another one, and it says go this way. So, if I stand in the middle and throw one, it says, go this way. If I stand in the middle of that and throw one, it says, go that way. So, I don't know exactly. Like, I guess there's supposed to be one somewhere underneath of here, but it's supposed to go down, not what it's doing. So, I guess... There's very few options for what I can do here. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know. Let me put this on so I can see what level we're at. We're at 38 currently. It was mentioned that I could have one of those possibly very rare bedrock level ones. But... I don't know. There's some definitely some deep cave cave areas what sounds to be behind me. Well, uh, here we are at bedrock. And I don't see a goddamn thing. So, I don't know. Maybe I will head... See, here's the problem. I now have one ender pearl. 
Yeah, I have 17 dust. Dust blaze powder. And you only need... I guess you need... Yeah, 12 to open the portal. And that's if there isn't any already in it. But the problem is, is Endermen don't always drop them. And they're not always reliable to find. Go away. I'm slowly gaining arrows, though. That's always handy. But I'm going to head towards the opposite... No. I think I'm heading the wrong way now. Blast. Okay, I want to go this way. Because... I believe this is where one of them was telling me to go. I figure if I go this way more... Because I didn't think it was supposed to be able to spawn within a hundred blocks of spawn. Hey, look, world glitch. No! I want to see if there's a fortress. No! Stop running from me. Ah. I'm getting so sick of creepers. They have literally been the bane of my existence at the, uh, uh, farm thingy. Okay. It says keep going this way. And it's not going down. Oh, seriously? Wow. There's either a very large hole in the ground. <laughs> I was going to say. Uh, see, now we're in a situation where we need more ender pearls. And this has been a recurring problem for me. Um... I do believe ocean biomes are considered invalid biomes to find a stronghold, but I don't know that for sure. I know it used to say whenever you started up a server, back whenever strongholds were originally added, it would say like invalid biome or something when trying to spawn the stronghold. So, so surface lava. But, uh, seriously, creepers everywhere. Hey, village. This is the village we found before? I don't know. Ooh, two endermen. Hey, endermen. I'm gonna be lazy. Come here. Yes. I figured they'd still be able to hit me, but I thought I would try anyhow. I didn't want to build a huge platform, but come on now. Not a single ender pearl. Give me your shovel. Thank you. You're being chased, sir. You're being chased. Uh oh. Damn zombies. What do these villagers do to you, huh? <sighs> and here happens to be the kind of issue I end up in. Oh, a diamond. That issue, of course, being that, uh... Wow. If only I had 17 emeralds. But anyhow... That issue always being that I can't find any Endermen, and then the night ends, and then then I can't do anything, because no Endermen. If I f would have found one Ender Pearl, you know, I could have done something, but no. Whatever. I guess I will have to wait 
ten minutes for night. Kill some more Endermen, if I can find any. And they can get back to you. Oh, now this is a good spot to stand to fight Endermen. I can see everywhere. But I think I'll go to the middle platform. But, uh, yeah, I'll be back with you guys shortly. And the sun has disappeared. I, I kind of started with a platform above my head, but then I ended up using that door I picked up for, that the zombie broke in the village and made essentially like a pillbox. But, uh, hopefully stuff starts spawning any moment now. Base light? It says zero. Of course, so that might just because of where I'm standing. No, it's still zero out here. So, I don't know. Oh, there's a spider and a skeleton. Oh, come on, I need some Enderman. Enderman! Give to me Enderman. I'm gonna have to go look for them, aren't I? Hello? Hello? Hmm. There's hardly anything spawning for that matter. This is a bit, uh, ridiculous. I am very sad about the fact that no Endermen are pretty much oh there's a zombie and a skeleton and another spider and a creeper and a zombie and a creeper down there hmm see this is what it's been for me finding enderman has been near impossible for some reason I know they're supposed to only be like a they're not a very high percentage, it's like 2 or 10 or something like that, but come on. This is a bit ridiculous. And it's raining elsewhere, so Endermen should be spawning here, in the desert. And nowhere else. But for some unknown reason, I'm not seeing any. You. Hmm. If the right things are going, I should be worried my sword's gonna break before this adventure is over. And I don't want it to break. Hmm. I have no idea. This is... This is ridiculous. This is what I've had to deal with. Just Enderman. Nowhere. And this is why I only had five ender pearls. <laughs> and I don't know what's going on with the lava light there. Look, that's really weird. And if your case you're wondering why I was swinging randomly whenever he wasn't even remotely in range, it's because I wasn't looking at him. I was slightly aimed at him. But, uh, I have thought about playing a super hostile map, but I think I'm going to wait for, uh, Vex's new one. I think it's going to be less... Oh, come on! Less, like, linear or anything, but... And I'm not sure if it's supposed to be another one designed for hardcore, but... I don't know. We'll see how that is. And maybe I'll play more intelligently than I did in the last one. Hey, Enderman. Oh, come on. I heard him teleport. I bet he walked in a little bit of rain there, teleported as he died, and if he dropped an Ender Pearl, I'm not going to be able to find it. Hey, there's experience here. And no ender pearl. 
There's a lot of spiders. And man, do I mean a lot of spiders. Holy crap. Okay. If it wants to somehow miraculously consume an entire another uh, baked potato while I'm moving, it can go ahead and do that. It's also a bit disappointing that I haven't found any... Well, that guy didn't drop any gold. That's what I was going for. But come on. You'd think I could get, you know, at least one Ender Pearl drop. I, was I not... Oh, uh, I guess I never explored over this far, but you'd still think it would load faster. Oh. Hmm. Well, this is a bit disappointing and kind of crap. Oh, wait. In the strange unloaded blackness, the Enderman slightly appears over the view with just his eyeballs. Seriously? Seriously? There is two more Endermen over by that lava pit. If this ends up being ten minutes of me not being able to find Endermen, I'm going to be very annoyed. I'm already kind of annoyed. Oh, you bastard. What the? Whatever. The fuck kind of noise was that? Well, so far I have a grand total of one Ender Pearl. I'm not sure how far one Eye of Ender will get me, but I guess I have it. Another Enderman. <sighs> oh, come on. Die and stay dead, please. Okay. Seriously, the sun is starting to come back up, and all I found is one freaking ender pearl. Come on. Chainmail. I can't find any more endermen. Well, crap. Hmm. Well, hopefully this one Ender Pro doesn't break on us instantaneously. Kind of want to get away from these cactuses. Just so it doesn't fall on them. Okay, I need to go this way. Ah, are you fucking kidding me? I believe I may just be destined to never find the stronghold. I know it has to be somewhere in this general direction. Well, I guess we'll make a boat and go diagonally from here until we find more land. Hopefully an actual, like, continent. This way. 
Who knows, maybe we'll get really lucky and it'll be a fairly close to surface underwater one. What is that? That is an abandoned mine shaft. A oh, big system of it, too. And I'm willing to bet that the stronghold is probably... Well, it might not be down there, because this is technically an ocean biome. But... Hmm... I do kind of want watermelons, because I am going to want instant... Well, the instant damage potions aren't really going to be necessary at the moment. Is this a continent, or is this just a half-decently large island? It appears to be an... Ooh. Hello. Ice. But what is it? Is it an actual tundra? Is it ice ocean? Frozen river. What happened to the boat? Huh. Hmm. We are now a fairly long distance away from where we started. That is for sure. Finding Enderman when it's snowing is going to be very difficult. So if you would kindly stop snowing, that would just make me very happy. Lava. Lighting glitches galore. I was thinking about looking into new snapshots, but... I don't know. I haven't yet. That's for sure. Can I find another desert? That way... Oh, uh, it doesn't look like I'm going to find a desert at all. I do like how there's new... Whoa. Oh, that's what I could do. I could always make a uh, nether portal. Go back, farm them at the desert, and come back to the same spot. The only problem is, is I don't know where I started in the nether. However, I don't really need to. I suppose. I do have diamond pick on me, so I could make that into obsidian and get it right away. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. Ow. I'm not entirely sure where it's going to pop out at, but I did figure I was going to do a set of nether rails at some point. So, I guess, is there lava under this obsidian? Well, not that piece. Not that piece. These are generally one thick to my knowledge. But, uh... Who knows? Maybe I'll get really, really lucky to make up for it, and I'll go through the nether and find another stronghold. Hell, I'd be okay with finding the stronghold that I was at. Just... anything. Anything helpful would be nice. Whoa! And that is why I'm holding shift. 
Okay. We are going to make a portal right about here. And I don't have a flint. I see gravel. I believe if you fortune gravel, you are guaranteed to get flint. And I have the iron from the blacksmith. Not that finding iron is hard. Oh. Okay. Now, I'm not sure if I'm close enough to my house for this to interfere, but I do have the coordinates, which I should probably screenshot just in case. Okay. I just noticed that flint and steel actually has a noise now. And we are in a hole. A very large hole. Hmm. Well, that dead ends there. This went from trying to find a strong hold. Is this the same? Yes, this is the same one I was in before, which means I can get here pretty quickly. Wow, what are the chances of that? That is crazy. I kind of want to signify the path Oops. So, hmm. Well, I'm going to have to farm a lot more ender pearls and maybe even more blaze rods, which hell, I could make a complete separate base over there in the tundra and have a nice snow base to work with. This other portal's where up there. I would be worried about using all of the uh, pick on this nether rack, but uh, this is not my best pick, so. Oh. Right. Put this here. Ow. Right. And... Oh. Well, I could always do this. That'll do. Oh. There. And so I guess I can go back home, and I'll be able to farm up more ender pearls from the house. Oh, I should probably block that off or something to let me know. Don't go down there. But, uh, yeah, I guess the short version of this story is... At least now I have a way to get there quickly enough. And these torches should signify the way back. So, I guess I'm going to call this an end, and the next time we meet up, I'm I'm going to try to play a lot more than I have been. I've been playing a lot of APB. I'm going to see if I can't get a much larger quantity of ender pearls. Oddly enough, the best place to get ender pearls is the place you need ender pearls to get to. But, uh, yep, 
I'm going to call this for now, so uh, I will see you guys next time. Have a good day.